Another area of concern, all of the Bay Area still in either extreme or exceptional drought. This is the latest drought map that uh, is released by the U.S. Drought Monitor. It, uh, they released it this morning, and you can see that all of the Bay Area is shaded either in red or dark red. Now, red means extreme drought. That dark red, it means exceptional drought. Uh, they are the two of the worst possible drought conditions that we are experiencing right now. Governor Newsom is urging Californians again to please cut water use as the state continues to feel the effects of the drought. Cronfor's Ashley Zavala has the latest. The governor is now asking Californians to reduce their water use voluntarily, not mandatory. This, as most of California, is considered to be in extreme drought conditions. Site. Governor Gavin Newsom signing off on an order urging people and businesses to cut their water use by 15 percent. We are encouraging people uh, to do the common sense. The order is not mandatory but voluntary. The administration is asking everyone to be mindful with water use like watering the lawn, doing laundry and taking a shower. Or not eliminating that time, not here uh, as nanny state. We're not trying to here be oppressive. Again, these are voluntary. Newsom's action in San Luis Obispo County Thursday comes as 50 of California's 58 counties now fall under the governor's drought-related emergency proclamation, with 42% of the state's population falling under that emergency. As a result of the last drought, Newsom noted Californians have been more mindful of water use and the state has been more efficient on water recycling. The sober reality is such uh, that here we are again, uh, and we will need to proceed uh, with the lessons learned from the last drought. This is an existential crisis that we are facing. Senator Andres Borges is the chairman of the State Senate Committee on Agriculture. He says the governor's action does not go far enough. We need to be asking Governor Newsom to use his authority appropriately, and that is instructing the relevant divisions of the state, like Department of Water Resources, that they must prioritize uh, as a matter of policy. Uh, human welfare and food production, because if they don't, we will literally be down a road we may not be able to recover from. In the state legislature, there are several proposals in the works to improve the state's water systems. Newsom and lawmakers are working to spend $5.1 billion on those efforts and on immediate drought response. At the state capitol, Ashley Zavala, Cron, 4 News.